hi beautiful people welcome and welcome back to the channel so on today's video we'll be doing uh, some cleaning and also prepare some mandazis or half cakes together so please sit and enjoy <laughs> and i hope you're enjoying the holidays and uh, as well as vlogmas yeah so today this is vlogmas a day 12 yes day 12 i was not able to post yesterday but today morning i've served <laughs> i've served yeah so please enjoy the video if you do kindly give this video a thumbs up and let me know what you think what you think on the comment section below and uh, one more thing you'll be seeing a lot a lot of my kitchen <laughs> this vlogmas so yeah Thank you so much guys for joining in. Thank you so much for your amazing, amazing support. I really, really appreciate it. I don't take it for granted. Yeah. So let me take this opportunity to welcome all all the new subscribers. Thank you so much for joining this family. I really really appreciate your support. So let me introduce myself. My name is Jen and I do tend around home. So that will be cleaning, cooking, uh hauls, everything homemaking and I also share my single parenting journey. So if that is the kind of content that you really really love, Please subscribe if you have not subscribed and you're watching this video. And if you have subscribed, thank you so much and may God bless you for me. And uh, karibuni, karibuni sana. So after the dishes are clean, the next thing I'll be doing is to make um, the mandazi dough so that I can let it rest. And I'll not be using the self-raising flour. 
I'll be using the normal all purpose and then just add some baking powder. So that's exactly what I'll be doing here. Again, I'll not be using milk and I'll not be using any eggs. So I'll just use the all purpose flour, some baking powder and some margarine and uh, some water, warm water. And that will be it. So one thing I've come to realize, the secret, or let me just share the secret to having any pastry soft or any anything that you make with flour soft or amazing or for it to turn out so good is how you make your do. So when it comes to chapatis, when it comes to mandazis, everything you're baking or everything you frying when it comes to wheat it's how you make your dough so how you make your dough is how is what matters that will determine the end products that you're going to have So the next thing that I'll be doing uh, is cleaning up now the whole kitchen, including the cooker and the floors. And then we'll head to the living room and tidy up that space.
so i hope you're enjoying if you're enjoying let me know let me know in the comment section below and also do you join my premier gang do you join my premiers yo they know themselves they know themselves thank you so much my premier gang you're amazing amazing people i love i love you guys so so much so if you're new here or if you'd like to join my premiers i premiere my videos on monday and thursdays at 3 p.m and and on saturdays at uh 1 p.m yeah so i premiere on monday thursday 3 p.m and on saturday at 1 p.m so join the premier gang because you we just get to communicate we get to chat over there and uh enjoy as the video plays so i'll be using uh water and some uh washing powder to clean the floors All the things you've been taught, you've been told Don't blink, don't run Don't turn left or turn right or look straight at the sun My mind's gone in circles, I'm trying to fight it Get in these voices inside to stay quiet Go to the place To the living room <laughs> That is how our living room looks like So we removed the carpet And uh, all the curtains and all the clothes are in that basin, the blue basin that you're seeing over there. And it's because we unhung them last night just to make sure they don't get rained on because it's been raining in Nairobi. And uh, of course, so that you can't. This is a new character development tenor. So that is what I did. And uh, that is just how our living room looked like, basically. So I covered the windows with the Masai Shuka or the Kikoi and uh, my son's uh, blanket. So all these clothes, some of them, like the ones I'm folding, uh, had dried up. And also the shears, but I'll not be putting the shears up here. And uh, I'll also be taking those clothes back outside to go so that they can completely dry. And then uh, even the pillowcases, they were all cleaned. So we'll just tidy up this space, hang the clothes, uh, clean the space, and then prepare breakfast. Get back to preparing breakfast. bags one i'll put them all the medicine in there and of late i've just been telling god just rebuking the spirit of sickness in my house hey yeah so the other bag was just putting my chargers uh everything all a few of my gadgets and uh, you can see the mirror <laughs> we've not put it back up because there's some there's some there's some screw thing that Ilitoka, but hopefully I'll be fixing it or get someone to fix it or find a way to fix it. So that's what I'll be doing. Another thing I'll be doing, I'll be removing the plastic table from here. So I'll use the the long table you're seeing to just place the radio or anything else because we will be painting it white soon. Although it's not supposed to, it will be acting as a TV stand until we get one. Because I'm finding this place a bit crowded. So I've decided to just do that. And it will still create some space like you guys will see. And just remove the plastic. Just get done with these plastic tables. And uh, I've had them for long. I've had those tables since 2013. 
2013 yes i've had them since 2013 for almost 10 years now so i'll just be using this table for the time being yeah before we get a new purchase so let's clean up this space I know that space doesn't look so good right now, but uh, trust me, I've been working on this house bit by bit, so we will get there. We will definitely uh, get there. So after I was done cleaning the house, I went to hang the clothes, and there they are. So I actually hanged all of them, and uh, the curtains as well. They were slightly damp, damp, okay, they were damp, if I may say so, because they had not completely, completely dried. And it was sunny. So, yeah, I was 100% sure they will dry up.
So here's our clean living room and uh, by the time I was done my son was awake. There he is. And uh, now that he's awake I just decided to give him a shower or a bath and then I also decided to take one. And I was happy at least the house was clean and I also cleaned up the washroom. Shower, I use the Sodoso shower gel and then I use the scrubbing gloves and then I also use a face towel so that's it hey guys I'm done with all the cleaning I've showered and I feel so good so I want to prepare actually there's so much nice outside and then we live close to the road but uh, I'm done cleaning, I'm done, and it is all clean. So I want to prepare breakfast really quick because I'm also hungry. I'm also hungry, and I'll do that with you guys. So you saw me make the dough for the mandazis. Imagine I've done all those chores, and uh, it's been resting. So to pick a mandazi. feels so good <laughs> okay guys you will see the bubbles in the cooking oil because i used the same cooking oil to prepare vichette before so what i do is just sieve uh, the cooking oil and store it so that's why you'll see a lot a lot of bubbling <laughs> in this cooking oil because for for the vichette it had um they had what do we call them eggs they had eggs so that's why you see the a lot a lot a lot of bubbling a lot of bubbles no, I don't want no rest. echoing around these walls fighting to create a song I don't want to miss a beat and I will go through the wastelands through the highways to my shadow through the sun rays and I this video i'll make sure to put a playlist of all my vlogmas videos and uh, if you have not caught up with them you can just catch up with them and uh, thank you so much guys thank you for the amazing support see you tomorrow